Hi and welcome to my first what's on my iPhone video and I'm gonna be showing you my phone case collections at the end of the video so stay tuned for that. So here's what the always on display mode looks like on the iPhone 14 Pro. So let's start on the first page. So we've got my most frequently used apps in here. So in the first folder, we've got Health App, VN, Google Photos, Instagram, the Notes app, and also Locket. I don't really use my Instagram actually that much, so I put, put it in this folder instead of outside with the other apps. Feel free to follow me. I have like my bookstagram and my main account. And here's the Notes app. I don't know why I did show these features from the Notes app as if no one else knows how to do it. But here it is. Also, I use my Notes app almost for every single thing. Like, I don't really use Notion or any other note-taking apps aside from Notes on my phone. So yes, I use it almost every day. Also, on the second folder, we've got Calendar, Gmail, and Docs. I open my Gmail every single day. We've got camera and I, again, I don't know why I showed the features as if no one else knows how to do it. And then we've got a clock, photos, WhatsApp, and Pinterest. Also, feel free to follow me on Pinterest because I often upload stuff there. Then we've got Line, Spotify, and Google Maps. Feel free to also follow me on Spotify. I've got like 50 playlists. Let me know in the comments if we have the same music taste. That'd be fun. Okay, so the second page, we've got the Bible widget app and some widgets. So on the first folder, we've got the photo editing apps like Jazz Cam, Normal, and Lightroom. Here's what Daz Cam looks like if you don't know yet. Um, so basically, they give you like these vintage looking photos. And there's like a lot of cameras to choose from. Some of them are paid though. But this app is absolutely cute. Even if like the free cameras are like really cute. And we have Lightroom. Lightroom is where I edit all of my pictures. I have a lot of presets here and it's just very i just love this app so much in lightroom you can adjust everything in your picture and yeah and then we have the widget app this is where i how i decorate my phone with the widget smith app Then we have the normal cam app. This is also a vintage camera app, which is also really cute. And there's the Polaroid mode. Where you have to wait for like the photo to develop. I guess it's kind of cute though. It gives you like the actual Polaroid effect. So it's kind of fun. And the second folder is full of apps that I don't really use and the third folder is YouTube, YouTube Studio and also the App Store. And on the third page we've got some widgets and some apps that I don't use daily. So we've got the Letterbox app. If you don't know what Letterbox is, it's basically a movie review app. Um, yeah, and I review movies there. I usually just put ratings on them. And feel free to add me there. My username is the same with my Instagram. So you can write reviews and put your ratings there. Also, I have this app called Ice Screen. It's also for widgets and this app is very cute to for decorating your phone. Um, I use it for like decorating my lock screen and some other on my homepage, as you can see. And I'll be scrolling down to 
show you the features it has. It has a lot of features. So, yeah. Then we have the Bible app and also PayPal. Also, I have this cute app where you can like interact with your friends. I can't really pronounce the name of the app, so I'll just like put the text on the video. Also, I have this widget from iScreen, which opens your Spotify. It's really cute. On the last page, we've got. First of all, we've got Kindle and some other stuff. So I have Kindles on all of my devices, such as my phone, my obviously my Kindle and my iPad as well. And you can read and sync across all your devices. Just put them online. Also, I've got this app for purchasing movie tickets and Snapchat. Fun fact, I keep a lot of food pictures on Snapchat for some reason. I don't know why. I don't post them, I just keep them in the memories. And I honestly don't know why. And like, let me know if you do that too. And then next we have my Goodreads. Feel free to add me. My Goodreads username is Stephen Strange, as in the Doctor Strange name. And I actually update my Goodreads frequently, so please add me there. <laughs> also, let me introduce you guys to Keys Fan. So Keys Fan offers cheap and legal OEM software key which is 100% official and enjoys online activation. They have 24-7 customer service and lifetime after sales. It's an excellent opportunity to renew the operating system and achieve an improvement in performance and security. So check out the links of the products and event page in the description. And also use coupon code SA50 to get 50% off on Windows series and SA62 to get 62% off on Microsoft Office and Bundle. And to know more about them, check out the description. I will link every thing down in the description. Moving on to cases. So I've got a new case recently. It's this dark grayish glitter case. It's actually really cute on my phone because my phone is a black phone and if I use a normal, regular, transparent glitter case, it will look just like white on my phone, which is ugly and which this one looks pretty great because it just adds sparkle to the beautiful black color. Also, this case is very easy to put on and take off and I really like holding this case. I don't know, it just feels good and the buttons are great as well. Next, we have our muffed case, which you have seen this if you've seen my iPhone 14 Pro unboxing. And I also love this case because it supports MagSafe as well. Also, if you've watched my iPhone 14 Pro unboxing, you'd probably know this case as well. It's the Stardust case. They're both pretty different. So I don't really like this Stardust case. At first, it looked cute, but then it made my phone look ugly because I have like a space black phone and this is just straight up white recently i also got this clear case because i just love clear cases and i also got a couple of cute phone straps i love them <laughs> and next we have the silicone case I really love this case like so much. It's really soft. It's crazy soft. I just love wearing this one. It's just really great. And like it's kind of thick. So it protects your phone well. Yeah. I love it so much. And I love this pink color. It's so pretty. And the buttons are perfect. They're great. They're so great.
and last one we have this clear case with the black frame i like this case so yeah one of my favorites and i'm currently using this case and it's from speaken regular clear case but yeah i love it and this is the one i'm currently using okay so that's it for today's video and i also have a lot of videos coming soon so if you really like this one go on and subscribe and i'll see you in my next one bye